Back on our show this Wednesday in the kitchen with our friend uh, Jason Hugay from the Steamboat Warehouse making us uh, seafood stuffed eggplant with some other good stuff in it. This is, uh, Mark, this is a, a dish that we do on occasion at Steamboat for an appetizer. Right. It's, uh, it's got uh, crawfish, crab meat, and shrimp, all wow. you know, local seafood products. Uh, what we do is uh, we did a, uh, an appetizer here before. Uh -huh. It was similar um, with the crust and we have the uh, moist uh, stuffing on the inside. Um, and we're going to top it with a little, we, we call it Jolie Blonde sauce. Uh, basically just an herb, cream sauce. You can actually smell the herbs. Gosh, and it, it smells so good. Um, people love it. So um, I can imagine. I figured, you know, we hadn't, we talked about this last show. We had, I hadn't brought it. So I said, well, mm -hmm. let me bring this this time. So this so, is on um, the menu most of the time. This is a special item. Okay. okay. So um, this is not always on the menu, but um, we do it on, you know, pretty often. Okay. Um, so what we would do with the steamboat is we go ahead and take one. Right. And this is one serving as an appetizer. Mm -hmm. So what we would do is take our sauce, and you just you don't want to uh, overpower the dish with the sauce. So we're just going to drizzle really lightly. Oh my goodness! You know, just enough to kind of you know give you just a little bit in each bite. Uh huh. Just so you taste some of that sauce. Exactly. Right. And so we're going to put just a little bit of green on there. It's and beautiful. I, I like to put some uh, just some fresh sprigs of parsley mm -hmm. around it also. Um, and this would be. Uh, Looks gorgeous, great. Yes. Gorgeous. Cannot wait to taste that. Sure can. So this is a combination of eggplant, crawfish, shrimp, crab meat. What type of breadcrumbs do you use? Uh, we use plain breadcrumbs. Mm -hmm. You want to take a little taste? And mm -hmm. you oh, go, yes. Miss Francis. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I use plain breadcrumbs because I don't like to, um, if you use the seasoned ones with the herbs mm -hmm. and stuff in right. it, it may change it. Yeah. Um, and we have herbs in the sauce already, so that's what, you know. We had the, uh, LR, uh, I'm sorry, the LA31 um, beer pairing that we spoke about last show. Right. Um, they came and we had a tremendous turnout. It was a great event. The beers that they paired with my four entree or four courses were perfect mm -hmm. pairings. Mm -hmm. um, you said they are out of where? They're out of Orneville, Louisiana, mm -hmm. and they have more beers than you would even think of. Um, some of them that, you know, like me as a beer drinker, I'm not, I have not been exposed to some of the things they have. And right. at first you may think, oh, I don't know about that. But once you try them, it's like they're all delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, the, the one with the dessert uh, went perfect. It was made with Mellow Joy coffee and chocolate notes in it. Yeah. So it went, and it wasn't sweet. It was just, just a little tiny bit of sweetness to go with my dessert, which was a strawberry swirl cheesecake. Interesting. And it was delicious. Yeah. That is delicious. You said the pairing event you have coming up in November has not even been advertised, but is sold and out. We, we, we're actually over um, halfway sold out. Oh, okay. So, um, mm -hmm. Which is quick because we just had mm -hmm. one Monday, and mm -hmm. as of yesterday, it was already, mm -hmm. you know, so um, that's good. But this one's going to be probably one I've been looking forward to since last year. I've been trying to get Duck Horn, which is my favorite vineyard. Uh, and I actually got it confirmed yesterday that they will be at my restaurant in Washington and to oh, send, send a representative to help us out or whatever. Where is that vineyard from? Um, California. Duck horn. Yes. Okay. Um, you can't go wrong with any one they want. Some of them <laughs> get a little pricey depending which ones you want. Mm -hmm. they're, they're all delicious. Um, the Pinot Noirs, the Cabs, the Merlots, whatever route you want to take. Mm -hmm. uh, they have a Sauvignon Blanc that I love. What's on um, the menu for the 4th of July weekend? Well, we're closed Fourth of July. Closed. So, <laughs> yes, ma'am. Uh, <laughs> just, just Saturday. Just okay. Saturday. Yeah. Saturday. We'll be open Sunday. Okay. Also, <clears throat> I want to uh, take that opportunity uh, because this weekend we had another uh, couple who came and sat down and said we came because we saw the chef on the show. Great. On the Good Day Sin Live. So I just want to say real quick, if you if you do come and you do come because you saw it on the show. Tell you waitress, because we love we love to hear that, you right. know, and, uh, uh -huh. and trust me, they come and run tell me, hey man, they saw you on the show. <laughs> like my wait staff, I have a great crew, uh, front uh -huh. and back of the house. Um, they let me go to Key West, Florida last week. Uh, that couple was of weeks nice. Ago. That was yes. awesome. Yeah. And I had a blast. And you so, still have a um, restaurant. Yeah, right. And, and everything went well, you know. So um, you know, delicious here, by the way. It's, it's great flavor. It. You really taste the seafood. Quick, uh, Matthew Definitely. McConaughey was in your neighborhood yes. a while ago uh, filming. Yes. I Did missed he ever make him. it to the restaurant? I missed him by probably a day. If I would have got his agent on the phone a day <laughs> ahead, because I had her, uh -huh. his agent was on the phone with me, and she said, I am so sorry, because he is doing back-to-backs, uh, meaning he's just mm -hmm. filming, 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 filming. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
And she said, intense. there's just no time. And I'm like, man, he's two blocks away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I missed it. But um, What about tonight? What, what can we expect tonight and tomorrow night and Friday night? <clears throat> tonight we have the beautiful soft shell crabs, the ones we stuff yeah. and I won awards with. Um, always good steaks. They're the best meat you can buy. Come and see us in right. Washington, Louisiana. Well, we'll close things out in just a minute back here in the kitchen. Stay with us. This game is never going to settle down. More surprises. We have no idea what's going to happen in this game. And a takeover that's in full swing. It's not too late to get into the house. Just go with it. Just go with it, man. And get more out of your summer. This is going to be an amazing summer. New Big Brother CBS Tonight. Hi, I'm Luke. And I'm Luke with Window World. Everybody knows about the lifetime warranty on our windows. Did you also know that we're your source for vinyl siding? With professional installation and the best R value in the industry, we offer quality value and energy savings all in one call. Call Luke at 442-LUKE. The people and places of Louisiana are truly one of a kind. But from our pine forest to our fertile fields and our capital city to our coastal waters, we all rely on the locally owned Good Neighbor Pharmacy to have what we're looking for when we need it. Many of our stores are well-stocked specialized diabetic shops, and our friendly pharmacists fill your prescriptions quickly and take time to 